Yesterday, December 7th, 1941. Today, our fellow citizens, our way of life. A date which will live in infamy. Our very freedom came under attack. The United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked in a series of deliberate and deadly terrorist acts by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. The victims were in airplanes, were in their offices. The attack has caused severe damage to American naval and military forces. Secretaries, businessmen and women, military and federal workers, moms and dads, friends and neighbors. I regret to tell you that very many American lives have been lost. Thousands of lives were suddenly ended by evil, despicable acts of terror. In addition, American ships have been reported torpedoed on the high seas between San Francisco and Honolulu. The pictures of airplanes flying into buildings, fires burning, huge structures collapsing, have filled us with disbelief, terrible sadness, and a quiet, unyielding anger. But always will our whole nation remember the character of the onslaught against us. These acts of mass murder were intended to frighten our nation into chaos and retreat, but they have failed. Terrorist attacks can shake the foundations of our biggest buildings but they cannot touch the foundation of America. These acts shatter steel, but they cannot dent the steel of American resolve. No matter how long it may take us to overcome this premeditated invasion, the American people in their righteous might will win through 